So this is how my <laughs> um, kitchen has gotten. <laughs> my countertop is a mess right now. I have stuff over there. Ah, look at the dishes. <laughs> Our new microwave. And it's become a catch-all for my spices, which is ridiculous because I have room inside of my spice cabinet. My coffee area is a mess, <laughs> which, you know, I remember I had my coffee bar over here and I took that out because I wanted more room over the holidays for my table. So, um, and then that I moved to my bathroom and it's become my vanity. My stove, it sucks. You guys have to see it when it's dirty because <laughs> it got dirty from dinner last night and breakfast this morning. But if you see, we took out that big, huge microwave that covered that entire space. We added a fan instead. My original plan was to like build a, uh, you know, like a nice fan cover, but I don't think I'm gonna be doing that now. Um, so that's how my stove, it, if you remember, I had those old, you know, I'm gonna see if I can insert a picture of it here. From what it looked like before in case you're new here. Um, but this is my new stove and I love it so much. It doesn't have a back, so it has a small fan there. It has a bread proofer. We got this because we thought we were gonna be staying here, but I absolutely love my new stove. So some changes in my kitchen and we gotta get all of this back to a good place because I feel like I am non-stop, you know, just moving stuff around, trying to get it done. Over here, my son's clothes are on the floor for some reason. So I'm gonna have to get those. I say about his clothes, but if you see, that's my jacket right there. And then some shoes I gotta put all away. So I put the basket here to help me put all the shoes away. Yeah, so we're going to get all this done. I've been feeling so, small. so my kids, as part of their chores, have to unload the dishwasher. And there was some stuff that was left in here, like the cups and things. So I'm just kind of going through them and seeing what was clean and what was not. And putting away what I thought was fine. Start. 
stars I wanna take a trip to Mars Nothing can break me Nothing can break me Okay, so I got the first lot of dishes done. I'm gonna, I think I should clean up that corner over there first and then kind of just move my way down. These water bottles, apparently nobody knows who they are, so I'm gonna use them for my plant outside and throw away the bottles. The container I gotta wash out. Those cups gotta go up there with the other cups. And then, you know, deal with all this. <laughs> so let's well, just to keep on going. I want to take a trip to Mars, nothing can break me, nothing can break me. So I bought these, like these icing hot patches because my back's been having problems and I forgot that I'm like allergic to adhesive. So I wore them like one one day and then another the next day. Then I started feeling like these patches on my back once I took it off and I'm like, what in the world? And my husband's like, well, you know, they have adhesive on them, right? I forgot that they have adhesive. Obviously they have to stick to your back. So I started getting an allergic reaction to them. And then now I have like where the four corners are blotches on my back from the adhesive. So now I know not to wear them consecutively like that, but you know, just something. Just the glass top from our other microwave. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I get too drunk and too scared and lie to you. If only you knew I would die to you. One of us, one of us gotta say the Change your mind for love or pity. Let me know not that now. Cause your love made me, made me go blind. What am I hearing? Saying you're moving back. When were you gonna tell me that? What am I hearing? It feels like a heart attack. Catch my breath again. How did you stop loving me? How is that even possible? Possible. How could we let love go? How could we move on? Move on. Why you wanna let me go? Nah, nah, now. Are you saying that to change your mind?
Let me show you this. So I moved the microwave. Apparently something spilled underneath there. So let me get that cleaned. No clue what that is. that sit there for a few minutes because it's like stuck and you know I wouldn't have seen it if I wasn't like bent down to clean this area and then I saw like stuff underneath there so it <laughs> just shows me that I need to start looking in other places into my life such a magic feeling you tore down my walls i wish i could go back so these cups have to go to the top but i'm gonna wait until that other one dries before i uh and then the shot glasses are from uh, people give them to my husband when they go places because he collects them. So. It's very close. I wish I could go back right before you told me I'm trying to change it all. But look at us now. You could have gone so far. I already went through all of my mugs to see what I was gonna give away. My mom took some of them and these are what's left. <laughs> so I need to put them in the giveaway pile. And I just know things will never be the same. We're like strangers again, again, again. Strangers again, again, again. We're like strangers again, again, again. I just know things will never Strangers again Strangers again I thought we'd never fall Could have tried much harder And all we have are scars You said we'd get so high Higher up than heaven You said we'd reach the stars But look at us now so there was something stuck on here so i was just trying to put some hot water on it to kind of help loosen it up and then i got my scrubber and i was trying to scrub it just lightly because i didn't want to scratch the surface and i didn't have any of that cleaner but um so this helped get most of it off and then for the rest of it i just grabbed the uh, magic eraser that i have Oh my gosh, I have been discovering that those are pretty amazing at cleaning and just getting stuff off. I even used it on my shower the other day and was amazed that I had to do so much less scrubbing as compared to before. It was pretty awesome.
get my head up again You said that you had to I'll try to forget you Just didn't think we'd end up this way Like strangers again already a huge difference. The littlest things can make such a big impact and I need to remember that. <laughs> now I'm gonna make my way over into the dining room. I saw how disgusting my lid was, so I am going to put that aside so that I can take it outside and scrub it off. Pick up the pieces of the floor. Just trust, trust it'll be all right. Your heart is lonely, but it's strong. Now it's not wrong. You'll discover the way, even if it feels lonely. Just trust, trust it. Tell all those demons they can hide They don't know the greatness you have inside No Stand tall and keep your head up high And just trust, trust it'll be all right Yeah Be still Okay, got the trash done, the lid is drying outside, got my table cleaned up, my son's backpack, and my laptop stay there for now. <laughs> I did notice I forgot to wipe down this, so I'm going to do that real quick.
so pretty new, but I don't want it to start getting all like gunky and stuff on there, you know. That's all done. Okay, so I got my music in my ear. That way when I want to talk to you, I can, because normally I have music going and then I can talk to you. <laughs> so I am breaking a sweat. <laughs> I'm gonna get some, take a water break um, since I already had my coffee this morning. I may not have another cup today. I'm not real sure. Since I've been eating better, I notice my energy is improving, thankfully. So sometimes I feel like I don't need my extra cup of coffee, although I still love to drink it. So I usually try to keep decaf on hand for when I just want some, but I ran out. <laughs> so, but, so I'm gonna take a water break and then we'll start with the island. We got it for Black Friday. I think it was on sale for like 14 or 15 bucks. And it's a battery daddy and it holds like all kinds of different sizes. It has a like a battery tester in it. And room more on the room in the back. So it's pretty awesome. I just ordered some more batteries too. Way to replace the uh, like the smoke detectors and stuff. And I didn't realize how low we were on. So like I ordered some more AAA and and I think it was, uh, what are those called? The square batteries for the detectors. I didn't realize how many batteries we go through. So I need to order more AA to get it stocked back up. But this is definitely good to have it on hand just because you never know when you're going to need batteries. And I put these by the ladder. This is to finish the, the trim and stuff in my room. I'm gonna be myself. I'm gonna be someone else. I'm gonna be myself. I'm gonna be someone else. 
I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. Try not to hold me down. Feel alive when I'm in this town. Dark as beautiful stars. I wanna drive a faster car. Nothing can break me. Nothing can break me. Try not to hold. So I was trying to be mindful when I sprayed, but I kind of forgot when I was spraying right there. So I stopped and felt the fruit and smelled them just to make sure I didn't get any of the chemicals on there. So I cannot remember when the last time this was this clean. <laughs> that cake I'm hoping is going to be gone. The pineapple I'm going to cut up later on. Those bananas, I should probably just end up freezing those. But yeah, so we're getting there. My cup of water, the potatoes I got to cook. That globe I put there because I'm going to be working on the schoolroom today. And I think that's going to go on the desk in there. But I'm not sure because we use it often. So my son is finishing up eating over there. Of course, he's just doing something else at the moment. He comes and goes. <laughs> but, I mean, other than that, this is looking good. My cleaning stash right here. Oh, and I am so happy we got this section. At least looking normal. I do need to figure out what to do with this though. Oh, yeah. So I gotta get this fridge clean. I gotta get my little coffee area clean. And that's just about it. I do still need to pick up all of these shoes, but that'll take about a second. So the rest of it will get done. So I just realized I'm super safe. Super late on making my lunch. And a lot of times my go-to will be like a salad or a stir fry or different vegetables. So that's what I did. Pulled out a bunch of vegetables and I'm just going to do a quick stir fry. And then I have some um, hamburger meat that I used for nachos. So it just has like taco seasoning on there. I'm just going to put that in there too for my like meat thing. <laughs> gonna do this real quick and then finish my cleaning. in the bottom anyways. Found some green beans in there, so I'm just gonna add some eggs. My newly clean food.
Oh well. So while that's cleaning, I'm gonna work on the or cleaning. I've been cleaning too much. <laughs> while that's cooking, I'm gonna be working on the fridge. Stop worrying about worrying. We will keep turning. Doesn't matter what I do. I do. Trying to be open and keep my head up to words and that spoken makes all the difference to me. You. Show you the place that I go to when all the lights are faded out. You're gonna see what I'm all about. When I opened it and looked at this part of the door, I could not believe how disgusting it was. I mean, it was so bad. I don't even know when the last time I cleaned it was. So I got that done. And I think on the next video, I'm actually gonna clean the whole inside of my fridge because that's probably getting at the point too. <laughs> So back to my quick stir fry really quick. So now that the vegetables have kind of defrosted from being in the freezer, it was bell peppers and some squash and then the green beans that I pulled out. The bell peppers and squash are ones that I cut up and froze myself. Um, it got like, you know, the water comes out of it. So I drained all that and now I'm just letting it like actually cook. And that's what I usually do if I'm cooking frozen vegetables is I let all the water kind of come in the pan from defrosting. I dump it out and then I just cook the vegetables like I normally would and they fry up pretty nice. I mean, I say fry, but you know, like saute up pretty nice. Then I just added the meat in there and this ended up to be really good and a good healthier, quick lunch that I could have on my diet. So, but I really liked it. I actually ended up making it a second time using some more of that meat because I wanted to get it used up. Um, and I'm trying to use the things in my freezer also. And I think I just added um, some other kind of seasoning in here once it was to this point. So I'm just gonna eat this and then we're gonna finish the coffee bar and then we'll be done. I got this off of Amazon and it's just like a bunch of different kind of teas and it came with some honey sticks plus I had already ordered some other honey sticks so I just put that around because we like to drink tea I think I'm gonna put this where I keep the cups
Okay, the part is done. We keep it sideways, because when you look like, like this, it's sideways, because it was always getting in the way of the light switch, and then it was hard to fill the water in it. So now we just pick this up and we're able to fill it from there. So that last area is all clean. We just pick up these shoes and we will be good. Okay, so I'm gonna end the video here because I'm tired. <laughs> and all that cleaning took me like four hours, <laughs> including making my lunch and eating it. Um, but yeah, <laughs> so I'm a little tired, but that's probably the best. Okay, so in the middle of me saying goodbye and that I was done and taking a break, my phone died. But while I was waiting for it to charge, I'm like, oh, I might as well just clean out the guinea pig cage. So I started doing that, and then I started washing her mats, and, you know, then it just became another little thing, but that's okay. Um, yeah, so we're going to stop this one here, and then I will continue on with the next one. I didn't get to the living room today, but really it's because I want to take off the, um, we bought like a cover and stuff. I want to take all that off. I want to wash it. I want to vacuum the couches really well. Um, and that's going to take some time and I'm just tired and it's coming up on, um, like snack dinner time for my kids. So <laughs> we're going to carry this one on to the next, uh, you know, the next video. But I thank you so much for being, being here. I hope that this video gives you some motivation and I thank you so much truly for just being here, hanging out, but I'll see you on the next one.